Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing Birchbox and Ipsy for the month of September. So if you're interested in my opinions on both, then just keep watching. So we're gonna start off with Ipsy this month. And the first thing in the bag that I took out was this brush. And it is by Luxie. It is called the Medium Angled Shading Brush. And it's got a little like um, angled tip to it. It's really soft. I used it to apply um, a gold shadow on my lid. And it turned out really well. So I think that's really awesome that they've been including brushes in their boxes lately. Next I went in with the Pacifica Blush Duo. And I picked the color on the right, the darker color. So there's a lighter one which I don't think would show up very well on my skin. Um, but would be a nice like everyday simple um, blush look. But this palette, oh my goodness, you can tell because it is like so... Um, so much powder kicked up. Look, even from doing that, you can see my fingerprint. But um, this is a very nice blush. It's kind of pigmented. It's very, um, it was kind of shimmery. And I I really liked it. It's so pretty. Um, it's not shimmery, it's more of um, satin, I guess. Because it's not a matte blush, but it's more of like a satin, I would say. But this is a big palette to include, not palette, like big pan size to include as like a sample size. So Ipsy, that was really good. I like that. Next thing is this REP, Real Elemental Practice Bio Fresh Mask with Real Calming Herbs. So um, I haven't actually tried this out yet. I'll try it tonight, let you guys know in the description box how I liked it. Um, Contains calendula and chamomile, which helps gently exfoliate and stimulate circulation. So that was pretty cool. I always like getting masks. You can try them out. And I got this um, MAC strobe cream in the color Pink Light. And as you can tell, um, I put it on underneath my foundation. But as you can tell, like I am glowing to the gods. So I did put on a highlighter, like of course, but even where I didn't, which is like all right here, it's so pretty. I'm loving it. That was a good touch, Ipsy, even though it's so tiny, but it was a good touch. Lastly, there's these powders in here and it's called Papaya Enzyme Powder Cleanser by Hana Lei. And basically it's like, it's a powder and you pour it into your hand. I read the directions online. Um, and then you put water in your hand and you mix it around and then you use it as a cleanser and just wipe it all over your face. I tried it um, before, it was a little too messy to film. Um, so just be warned, it is very, very messy. But it was actually pretty cool. It was kind of a fun experience. I felt like a scientist basically, but um, I thought it was pretty cool. So that was a good touch. Moving on to Birchbox for this month. So as you can see, the um, front is like embossed with gold. And they had this thing where like you're supposed to draw on your box for this month and then you can send them like pictures. I thought that was a really cute idea. Get very interactive with your um, group. The first thing I picked up out of this box is the Daily Concepts Your Facial Mini Scrubber with Smart Technology. And this is the gentle version. It's a travel size makeup remover and exfoliating face scrubber. So it's basically like a little sponge. Um, looks like a loofah, but it's for your face. And so you just rub it on your face, you rub your cleanser in with this. And I thought that was a really cute idea. This is the one that they let you pick. And I picked this one because I just thought it was so cute and like I had to have it. It's very soft. I've used it once before. Um, and it was like, I don't know, it was a really cool experience. It was nice and gentle. So it's a nice gentle exfoliation if you have sensitive skin. I thought it was really cool. Um, the next thing is this deep moisture hair mask. I haven't actually tried it yet. I'm gonna try and try it tonight. Let you guys know in the description box um, how it went. But Marula is a really good brand. And anything like, any hair oil stuff is always really good for my hair. So I didn't actually mind getting this in. You know, you know guys that I don't like getting like hair products and stuff in with my makeup products, but it's fine. This was okay. Um, the next thing is this Kiehl's Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleansing Mask with Amazonian White Clay. This looks really cool. I'm excited to try it. Um, I'm always up for clay masks, so that was a cool touch. And then I've used the MAC 
Extreme Dimension 3D Black Lash Mascara. This was a really cool like packaging tube, like that's pretty cool. And I do really like this wand. I had a mascara before like this, I think it was a Mary Kay one, um, that has a wand similar to this. But this worked really nice, I liked how it looked. It's nice, like a, um, very kind of dramatic, like if I didn't have on eyeshadow you'd be able to see it a little bit better, but I think it's really good. Another MAC product, very excited about that. The next thing is this Pixie by Petra lip uh, oil. I think it's a plumping lip gloss, that's what it was, in the color Sheer Rose. And this is like a really pretty color, like it's so pretty and glossy. It's a good thing I like glosses. <laughs> and the plumping effect is actually not like too much burning. I feel a little bit tingly, but it's not burning. So yeah, it was a good touch. So, who do you guys think won this month? Was it Birchbox or Ipsy? Birchbox, Ipsy, Birchbox, Ipsy. In my opinion, it was... Oh! I think it was a tie this month, actually, for once. Birchbox did not get beat out by Ipsy. Um, I think it was a really good touch that they put in. Um, they let you allow, they allow you to pick products that you want. So I got to pick this little scrubber tool and that was really cool. I got to personalize my box. And then also the um, Pixi lip gloss and the MAC mascara, like these were good touches in the box. Usually it's like really odd, random um, makeup products, but that was pretty cool actually. Um, and then Ipsy was really good because I got the MAC cream and that was really nice. The blush was amazing and like, Weird face products, like this powder cleanser, like where did that come from? But it was cool because I felt like a scientist making my own little cleanser. So it was cool. It was cool to me. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you guys so, so much for watching. Um, if you like this video, give me a like, subscribe, comment down below. Um, go follow me on Instagram at Hyatt's Vicky, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.